Moscow's Triumph Gallery is shining a spotlight on contemporary Romanian art. Its new exhibition is split into two sections, east and west. A total of 21 artists are featured. Each half of the show has its own curator. The West Romania section of the exhibition is the responsibility of Jana Smirova. She says a closer look at art from the region reveals inner controversies. Sadly, not many people know what is happening with our closest neighbours in Eastern Europe. So initially, the idea was to have a glance at our closest neighbours and mainly at the ex-socialist states. As it often happens with a group exhibition, when you immerse yourself in the context, interesting details and internal controversies within the country emerge. The largest of the Balkan countries, Romania has witnessed changing empires, from Roman to Austro-Hungarian. It then lived under communist rule until the 1989 revolution. Now it enjoys an alliance with NATO, which dates back to 2004. But Smirova believes the country is still seen as exotic. For a Western spectator, any exhibition by an Eastern European artist is still something exotic. There's something unexplored, curious, interesting and not fully understood. We perceive it in a different way, as something closer and more understandable. The Eastern side of the exhibit includes artists from Bucharest. The section's curator says these works are less engaged in social or political dialogue. Focusing on Bucharest, I try to kind of select the artists that uh, are visionaries, that they do art uh, with the, the face back towards society, that they don't engage in uh, political art. The showcase is part of a series which will also highlight the current art scene in Azerbaijan, South Korea and Iran. The Romania exhibition is set to run until March 13th.